Hi guys, it's Erica. Welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to be reviewing the January BoxyCharm box. So here is my box for January. This is my second subscription to BoxyCharm. I have been subscribed to Sephora Play as well as Ipsy and I can say without a doubt even though this is only my second box that this is my favorite subscription box. I'm not just saying this. Nobody's paying me to say this. I paid for this box myself. I didn't get it for free. I really, really thoroughly enjoy BoxyCharm boxes and this is only my sec second one. I would say BoxyCharm was first, then Ipsy, then Sephora Play. Um, just the fact that you get full size products, you're only spending $21, one product, paid, one product in the box pays for the subscription itself and it just has changed my life about purchasing makeup and how I buy makeup and trying out new makeup. So the theme for this month is Rock 2018, hence why it is a January box. And you, um, we got in here a Dr. Brandt Pores No More Luminizer Primer, It Cosmetics Brow Power Universal Eyebrow Pencil, Crown Pro Glam Metals Palette, Pira the Complexion Authority Bronze and Brightening Cheek Palette, Palette, and the Girl Girlactic Matte Lip Paint. So. Um, the cheapest thing in here is the Girl Lactic Matte Lip Paint, and that's $23. Boom. It's already paid for. So, the first thing that I'm going to pull out is the Pores No More Luminizer Primer, and this is by Dr. Brent. And this is what it looks like. I'm really excited to try this because I actually have swatched it on the back of my hand. And girl, the way that that glow... Mm. Uh, that's why it's called luminizing primer because it's definitely a luminizing primer so I'm going to show you on my hand what it looks like I haven't actually used it on my face yet but this is how it comes out and look at that oh my gosh like is this not love and it doesn't take much to rub it in and as you can see it goes in but it gives my hand a nice illumination so I cannot wait to try this I'm so looking forward to this um, the next thing I'm pulling out is the pure bronze and brightening cheek palette and this is what it looks like um, I like the packaging itself it's really nice it's white um, what I'm not gonna like about it is when I'm touching it as I have my makeup on and it's gonna be makeup all over it but anyway, um, this is what it looks like. And these colors are gorgeous. I'm just not too sure how it's going to look on my skin tone, especially with um, this color right here. But they swatch really, really well. So I'm going to swatch them for you on my hands. So this is what they look like. And then swatched over the primer. Pigmented AF. Mmm pigmented AF so of course this color I might I might have to use with a very very light hand but as you can see they are very pigmented so I'm actually kind of excited now that I've swatched them again because I swatched them before I'm kind of excited to use them the next product that I have up is the Girlactic Beauty Lip Matte Lip Paint and this is in the color color is this kind of similar what I have on my lips today I got in my previous um my December boxycharm and it's this pretty vulgar my lips are sealed liquid lipstick these not even colors I normally go to but yeah and this is a full size product sorry I don't remember how much it is but this is from December so back to January um the girl like the beauty matte lip paint and this is in the color posh Again, this is another color that I would I would normally not drift to, but I think with a nice brown liner, it will look good. It has a typical, you know, doe foot applicator. And to swatch it, it swatches really nice. It smells really good. It has like a kind of chemically smell to it, but it smells good too. A sweet smell to it. And that's what it looks like swatched. It is matte. It's just wet right now. And I also tested it under the water as it uh, dried down and it didn't budge. So that's our Girl Lactic Matte Liquid Lip Paint in the color Posh. 
Next is the It Brow Power, and this is the Universal Color Taupe, Universal Brow Pencil, and the U Color Universal Taupe. Um, they say it depends on how you use it will determine how light or dark it is. So what I like about this pencil is the fact that it has a spoolie already attached to it, number one. And then here, the thing that I somewhat don't like is how the tip of it is. And so it's kind of thick for what I normally use, but as I was saying, when you, if you do light strokes, it will be very light. And if you do dark, I believe it can get as dark as you need it to. So light strokes for your fair ladies, dark strokes for the darker ladies. And as you can see, this is gone still a little wet. But this is a universal taupe. And I'm sorry, I forgot to mention the prices of this. So the Girl Lactic, I said, was $23. The It... Brow Power is $24. The Dr. Brandt Pores on More is $38. And the Pure Bronze and Brighten Cheek Palette is $34. The last thing that was like the piece de resistance in this box is the Crown Pro Glam Metals Palette for $25. This is what it looks like. Come on now. You got a whole eyeshadow palette whole eyeshadow palette in your box so let's let's y'all just want to get to the point comes with a little cover how cute is this with this little guitar mirror in these colors boxy charm i'm brand spanking new didn't even have to wait on a wait list that long why y'all doing people like that like <sighs> mm, i'm not even that big into makeup and i'm just I'm here for it all. I'm here for it all. So anyway, um, it comes with nine shadows and one of, is it one? Yeah, one of them, the black metal being the only matte one. I'm definitely going to swatch them for you. So just to swatch them row by row, I'm start with the top row. I'm going to swatch punk, wild thing, and black metal. Punk, Wild Thing, and Black Metal. Black Metal, as you can see, um, skipped a little bit on me as I was swatching, but the Punk, woo, yes, yes, hunty. So next, I'm going to swatch Rock On, Rebel, and Heavy Metal, which is the second row. It's a green, gold, and blue color. This is really interesting right here. And that's how it looks. Swatch that blue. Oh my gosh, that blue is looking lovely. Oh my gosh. And then for the last row, we have the Wicked, Glam Rock, and Pop Rock. And these are the neutrals of the bunch. And here are the colors here. We have the Wicked, Glam Rock, and Pop Rock. This is a really nice neutral color with shimmers in it. I think that looks good. So that is all for the Boxy Charm review. Thank you for watching my video. If you like what you see, hit like and definitely subscribe. My kids are here, so I have to get ready to go. So again, I uh, will definitely come back next what next month in February to do the next Boxy Charm. I want to thank you for watching, and remember as always, peace and happiness. Bye, guys.